Hey. <laughs> I can't complain. Blessed to be here. It's a great shoot today. I'm supposed to be honest, right? Yeah. Um, well, let me predicate that by saying I have five younger sisters. I'm very close with all five of my younger sisters, so no. I, I, I actually, I, I wanted a boy um, because I have five younger sisters. But uh, then after we started actually trying, I've been with my wife. Uh, we dated for 10 years we've been married for four after we started trying and realized that actually making a baby isn't as easy as just hey I want to make a baby and this is going to happen right now um, we tried for a little bit and uh, then just started it. my mind changed and I just wanted what God wanted me to have you know what I was supposed to have to learn and grow and, and, and become the man I'm supposed to be and, and whatever is healthy and uh, then we got this little miracle and, and I wouldn't change it for a world for the world but um, you know it, it's taught me that you don't always get what you think you want you get what you need um and when you need it and i needed a daughter um i don't think i, I get much of a choice in the matter i think uh, everybody's kids absorb everything about them whether we want them to or not and i think that that's the the biggest responsibility of being a parent is you know getting in touch with yourself and letting yourself know this little person from the day they are born is going to put all eyes and ears on me and my spouse and try to emulate us um you know they're going to learn to talk like us they're going to say the same words we say especially the ones we say when we think that they're not listening when we're in the kitchen and they're in the other room and we're cussing about you know dropping a plate or arguing with somebody on the phone or uh, something didn't go right at work and how we handle that or crying in the bathroom because something went wrong. Those are the things. Those are the things that your kids are going to do. Not the things that you want them to do. Not the things that you tell them to do. You know, they're going to follow your example. Kids don't listen, but they definitely follow your examples. And uh, that's what I think about Layla. So I'm very mindful to try to lead with action and not worry so much about what I say. I think that uh, my philanthropic work and the values were set in motion by my parents. Like I said, Black Carpenter was inspired by my grandmother, my parents, and how I was raised. And uh, at this point now, it's time to pay it forward. It's time to pay it back. I, you know, I wrote the book before I had a kid, so I had a lot of time and a lot of years to think about the morals, the pearls of wisdom, the lessons that they gave to me, the the way that they lived their lives that inspired me, and you know what I took away from it. Now it's time to turn around and literally re-sow those seeds in Layla and make sure that she has the same pearls. Um, and that's all I think about every day. Communication. Uh, Paul and I, <laughs> we're list makers. So, and we're goal setters, you know. So every year we have goals. Every month we have goals. Every week we have goals. Most days we have certain goals. And, um, you know, we have goals as parents. Um, objectives, uh, you know, what do we hope to accomplish by the time she's three months, by the time she's six months, by the time she's a year, and that's stuff from saving school money, you know, for her college fund, to uh, pre-registering for the best swim care classes, which start at four months old, you know, uh, or swim classes start at four months, infant swim. Um, so it's just trying to figure out what we want to do, speaking it into being, and then planning and acting accordingly so that those things come to pass and um, I've got the best partner you know that I, that I could ever have and uh, so far so good it's only been six weeks but uh, I guess we have a lot more discussing to do because she's uh, she's about to start crawling soon and that's when uh, <laughs> all hell's about to break loose I think.